Welcome to Game 7 here on EA Sports. Really looking forward to this one tonight. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. And that's poked away. Columbus takes hold of the puck. Knocks the puck loose after a solid hit. Avoids the poke check and maintains possession. Jocelyn for the puck and he loses control. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Well, that's desperation at his finest to be able to get to that puck and send a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. They've got numbers. Tremendous athletic stop with the glove by Montembeau. We're still in the early stages of this period. We're still scoreless. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Takes a knock, but he's still got the puck. Columbus has it in their own zone. Sends it into the offensive zone. Montreal's looking to break out. Moves the puck. and play. The Blue Jackets win the draw and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Slides the puck across to Anderson. Montreal's got it along the wall. Looks to set up at the point now. Hammers it! Oh, I thought he had the corner and just missed. Well, it looked like he did. You can just see that inside leg just bear down the bottom hand as well, but he's unable to convert. Evans brings it in. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Columbus looks to attack. Oh, score! And that's his first goal of the postseason ever. And he'll take it. It's much needed too, James. You get to the playoffs, you want to make sure that your teammates have trust in you and you have trust in yourself because you want to be an impact player. That's a nice start. Well, this is a really smart shot through traffic, James. The recognition of the net front presence in screen and the goalie drops to the butterfly position, really tries to make himself as big as possible, hoping that the puck just hits him because he can't see it. The Blue Jackets are first to light the lamp tonight. Let's see where it goes from here. There's been some back and forth action, and you have to believe that sometimes when there's one, there's more to come. Takes a shot. Get the stop. Big save by the goaltender once again. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, Columbus has the 1 0 lead. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Across the line along the left wall. And that's blocked from someone in front. Passes it over. Good hook to bump him off the puck. Can't hang on to the puck after taking a knock. And that's broken up. Can't connect. Columbus gets a hold of it. Hammers went from the point. Denies him with the save. Cutting to the front of the net. Big time save. Oh my goodness. Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. I don't think anyone minds watching that one again, James. I mean, he's so dialed in in his crease. You think this is all but in, and then he comes out of nowhere to make that spectacular save. He never gives up, and he finds a way to get to it. 
Officials have got both teams ready, and it looks like play is set to resume here. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Montembeau is a competitor, and he is not afraid to compete for every single puck and outwill and outbattle his opponent. And that highlight reel save, it is something, James, because just when you think it's almost in, he finds a way to get to that puck. Such an athletic goaltender. Great poke by Johnson. Takes the feed from the left side. The Canadians played along the boards. Great hands to handle the saucer feed. Picked up along the boards by Doc. Moves it to Goudreau. Johnson's got it in the defensive end. Puck picked up by Goudreau. Montreal's got a hold of it along the wall. Now a quick pass to Line. Some great thievery in the open ice. And there's the save. Montreal's got the puck now. Tries to get it to Gallagher. Shot! Oh, what a blocker stop by Merzlikens. Here's a shot. Blocked in traffic. The Blue Jackets cross the line and gain the zone. And that's just out of reach. Scooped up along the wall by Monaghan. Montreal's got the puck. Puck scooped up by Dvorak. Oh, just a textbook hit. Slides it across to Cooley. Centering pass! Let's go! the midway mark in this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Face off here on the neutral side, and we are back underway. Shot! Stopped by the goaltender. Takes the puck, but hangs on to the puck. They've got some momentum here. Big time stop. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well. And this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. Here's a chance! Makes the save with the glove! And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Here in the late goings of the period, we are all tied up in this one. Suzuki's got the puck and they'll go on the attack. Tries to the crease! And he opts to wait for more support. Taken along the wall by Suzuki. Quick feed to Slavkovsky. Merzlikens hangs on to the puck to stop the play. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. And off the draw, they win possession. Puck grabbed by Olivier. Dumps it into the Ozone. Takes the feed. Here they come through center and into the offensive end. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. But he's got such a slick set of hands. He's trying to manipulate his opponent one by one, but he tries one too many, James, and he loses the puck. Merzlikens has it and freezes the play. Got possession of the puck. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Quick pass to Marchenko. Here he is with a backhander. Oh, and what a save as he gets the one two. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. Here's a short pass to Matheson. Cuts to the front. And he hits one of his own teammates with that shot. 
Takes that pass back to the point. Big save oh. off the post. And with that, the first period is in the books. Both teams with a chance and a refresh. We'll get a clean sheet of ice and come back with period number two. Looking for the latest news, scores, and statistics? Check out our team website. for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Been a fun one so far. Neither side giving it up. Still time here as they open things up in the second. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment? The Blue Jackets need to step up offensively and more confidence with the puck chains. They're really not entering with any conviction, and they're staying on the perimeter. They have a minority of shots, and they're lucky. They're real lucky that this game is still tied. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. The Canadians win the faceoff. Gives up the body for the block. Grabbed along the board by Johnson. Pumped off the puck. Moves it quickly over to Johnson. Off a stick. Montreal's gained possession along the boards. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. And that's a smart heads-up play by Marchenko. Sends it ahead to Johnson. Slides the puck over. Quick shot! Denied by the blocker. Montreal's got it in their own zone. Moves it to Suzuki. Gives some nothing in front. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Smart play to take possession, sneaking in off the wing. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Oh, and a great defensive play there. Oh, just got a piece of that one. Look at that one to keep it up. Mazikins defends his crease and doesn't give up anything on that one. possession and he takes the feed Columbus can play it from the back end fantastic save Montreal's got the puck behind the net here they come down the right side and on the attack denies them Columbus looks to move the puck from their own end they try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone handles the pass at center and that's knocked away. Picked up along the wall by Cooley. Tries to get it over to Barron. Slides into Doc. Fires it on net. Off the outside of the post and stays out. The Canadians bring another one off the post. So frustrating, James, in a tie game where they have the opportunity to go ahead. Listen, the goaltender's going to tell you they're in good position. They're forcing that wide shot. Moves the pass in front. Oh, up the iron. Sends the pass over. Excellent stick work on the play. Tries to feed it over to Sillinger. And he takes the feed. Throws it in. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Gallagher's gaining momentum. The Habs looking against the half wall. Works it across to Pizzetta. Denied by the goaltender. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. It's all tied up. Dvorak won the draw there on the attack. Oh, much respect as he blocks that one. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. And now it's grabbed by Wierenski. Columbus is across the line and on the attack. Quick pass across to Severson. Slides that one right across the blue line. Quick feed to Marchenko. Cuts to the point. Stones him in front. back half of this period we got a tie game
And they win the draw on their own end. Quick pass to Caulfield. The Habs carry it along the wall. He sends it down low. Columbus takes possession along the wall. Here's a short pass to Boudreau. Great defensive effort with the strip. Picked off by Savard. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Matheson. Dumps the puck in. Feeds the puck across to Slavkovsky. Caulfield's taking it from his own end. And here's the pass to Suzuki. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Columbus looks to get things going now with the puck. Kroborov's got it against the boards. The Canadians gain possession in their own end. And he slides it quickly to Doc. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. Oh, there's a great stop by Merce-Leakins. Columbus has it behind the net. The Canadians take possession in the neutral zone. Moves by the check. Stops! And they take a drive to Clutch City as they take the lead. Well, the lead is in their hands, and now it's about building off of that. Good shift management, dictating pace, controlling the offensive zone. Everything now is on the line. Well, this is an incredibly intelligent shot, James. It's recognized that there's net front presence in front of the goaltender who's dropping to a butterfly to try and take away as much net as possible, and it finds its way through. The Canadians have persevered. They've weathered the storm, and look at this. They now lead here late in the second. Uh, this should give them a real jolt here, James, and they'll head into the intermission with the lead, and this is really important that they feed off of that energy, and they come out in the third fly. There's a shot! Oh, he gets a blocker on it! What a stop by Montembeau! Here he is, shot right inside! Shuts him down! Columbus has it near the wall. Still has possession. Moves it over to Fentilli. Drives to the paint! Oh, what a save in front! Oh, these are the saves when you know that the goaltender is dialed in, James. The ability to get to the top of the crease and be square to the shooter, that's a great save. Fires it! Oh, and he steps up with that glove to stop that one. Brzezikens has been terrific tonight, James. I mean, he's faced a high volume of shots. His save percentage is through the roof, and he's really kept this game tight with his performance. Montreal's up for good reason. They have been the more complete team offensively, which is why they lead late in the second. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. Here they come on the attack. Takes the shot. Way too much congestion blocks that. And the middle frame almost done. Montreal's playing it from the side. Scores! Make it three in a row, and they're coming out. Well, they certainly are three in a row. They've got their opponents on their heels. It is a way you can steal it. The energy every single shift. They're getting it in. on the bench after that last goal and just certainly not happy with the effort that his team is displaying. You can see the feedback that's coming to athletes and he wants to see a difference out there. He needs someone to make an impact. Montreal's been dominating the pace of play all night and Cheryl, they've now extended this lead to two. It's been a dominant performance, James, right from their puck drop and now they'll be heading into the intermission. They'll want to make sure that they reset. You know their coaching staff is going to be telling them, listen, right from the third period on, we got to find a way to finish, execute and continue what we started. Knocks the puck loose. Columbus gains the zone and on the attack. Stopped by the... No, he, he scores! He thought he had it, but it must have gone off him. It's in the net, and that's a goal. I just love the effort to set up this goal, James. I mean, knowing that you have the puck on your stick, it's a real unselfish play because everything he is doing is calculated to manipulate his opponent because he wants to feed his teammate. The 
the Blue Jackets will look to build on some momentum here before the period closes out after that goal. They need to continue that momentum as it nears the end of the second, and they want to carry that energy into the intermission. Real important that they can have an opportunity to collect themselves and come out strong in the third. will get one last chance to catch their breath, and then it's on to period number three next. We are moments away from the third period. The truth lies here. Time to find out who wants it more tonight as period number three is underway. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? The Blue Jackets, Coach, won't be happy with their performance tonight in the effort areas and the habits. I mean, they really haven't been hard on the puck. They haven't been strong or physical. And as a result, their opponent has taken it to them because they've had the puck the entire game. Matheson's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. Scrum along the boards. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. That's certainly not going to help the team. I mean, they're losing by one. They're going to find a way to get to the middle. Because he can't see the puck. I mean, they work 
on tracking exercises all the time, but you can't see it when you've got bodies in front of you. So this is a smart shot that makes its way to the back of the net. Montreal's been total non-stop action on the offensive end, and they continue to lead in the third. Columbus wins the draw in the neutral zone. Moves it to Good Branson. Can't hang on after that hit. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Harvey Kennard. Takes the pass. Toss up the puck after that hit. And a great save. Well, that shot came quick and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. Quick feed to Johnson. And there's a great save by Mojumbo. Quick pass to Suzuki. Here's a shot. And that one's turned aside. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Montreal's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. The Blue Jackets win the draw. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Slavkovsky's got the puck in his own zone. Here's a short pass to Barron. Looking to make something happen along the boards. The Canadians gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it quickly over to Caulfield. Feeds it to Juracek. Here they come on the attack. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Quick feed down low. Slides it across. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Merzlikens. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. More than half the period has expired. We've got ourselves a 4-2 hockey game. Montreal's got the puck inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. There's the whistle as the goal hangs on. Montreal's been going in one direction all night long, and that's to the net, and they lead it in this third. Ducks won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. got a hold of it along the wall. Tries to get the puck over to Doc. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Into the offensive zone. Sillinger's stick handling in his own zone. Great pass from off the right side. Takes a shot, and that's blocked away. Passes it over. Montreal's got the puck in the defensive end. The Blue Jackets take possession here in the open ice. Jabs the puck away. Fires it into the offensive zone. Columbus has the puck. Through center. Off the left wing and into center. Oh, can't get it to go. Ron has a good scoring chance. It's a quick release shot, but unable to convert. And that's knocked away. Columbus plays it along the wing. Montreal's got a hold of the puck now. Well, you're leading late in the game. You've got to find a way to kill the clock. You know what the best thing is to do? Make sure it's not in your zone. That takes the pressure off, and that's a smart dump right there. Puck moved over to Marchenko. All alone! He scores! Oh, wow! What a finish! Well, I love that he used his speed and didn't slow down, James. And it's all about patience and composure, outweighting the goaltender, finding the room and burying it. Coaches are always harping on pass execution. Well, this is a clear example. When the pass is crisp and it's on the tape, it's on the money, it finds the back of the net.
Columbus has dramatically changed the look of this game here in the third. Uh, two good teams going head to head, and this is going to be a nail biter right to the finish. You can feel the energy after that goal, and hey, who's going to change momentum now? And the puck is scooped up here to the open ice by Slavkovsky. Taken by Monaghan. Pass taken behind the goal. And he slides it quickly to Fentilli. Oh, great move to sidestep the check. Montembeau's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. The Canadians been going in one direction all night long, and that's to the net, and they lead it here late in this third period. They win the face-off here in their own end and take possession. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Drives it to the crease! And that goes off course off a of body. And is it along the blue line? Sends it out front, puts it off the post. Made the stop on the play. The Canadians pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. And now he moves it quickly to Caulfield. Shot! And the puck dies with the trapper save. Here in the late goings of the period, Columbus has really picked up the tempo over the last few minutes, but they still need another goal to tie. And they win the offensive zone face-off, and here we go. Columbus gains a hold of it. Provorov's gained the line and on the attack. Columbus has the extra attacker out with the goalie on the bench here. And there's a puck at the point. Moves it to Provorov. Trying to get the puck away from the inferno here. Receives the pass. And it's a quick pass to Line. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. A chance to end Scores it. into the empty net. And that should probably wrap this one up. Yeah, well, it's the only deal. James the insurance marker. A lot of fun as well. Goal scoring is fun. Doesn't matter how it goes in, even if it is an empty net. That's a strong effort all the way around. Stingy defensively at the end of the game, and they're able to get that empty netter. And in the nine minutes here, James, it should seal the deal. You know, it's a huge game when a coach reacts like that behind the bench. He knows what game he's in. This entire team does now as he's going up and down the bench. We don't see it often, but when you do, you can't help but smile. Perhaps after that empty netter, should just simply need to let the clock run out now. Seal the deal, and you look at the opponent, and you can see their body language. They know it's all but over. Suzuki's gained possession inside the neutral zone.